Hi guys, welcome to Foresta Studio. Today I'm gonna talk about the Corona light. Okay, here we go. Let me draw a plan as usual. 10,000 by 10,000, no segment. Another teapot. 800 Let me run a test Okay, and a Corona light I'm gonna modify a bit in the render setup before and override a standard corona material to the whole scene yep good to go let's take a look at some parameter of the light here we have the on and off switch easy to understand we can enable the target but it doesn't matter because this is a fear. So down below we have some option. Rectangle. Now the target is working very well. Disc. Cylinder. I often use the rectangle or this. Okay. Here we have the intensity control. For example, we can increase. I will leave it 100. And the unit is nothing important. Just leave it as default. And we can assign the color. Beautiful. The Kelvin temperature, the lower it is, the warmer light is. Want to make the light cooler? Just increase it. I'll leave it 3000. And the text map, I'm going to talk about the text map later in the sample. And what else? Ah, very important. I will increase it slowly so you can see the difference between 0 and 1 so the directionality control this angle let's jump to another example to understand clearer about the light I'm gonna import an external model mosh file wait a bit okay what do we have here here we have a wooden floor very old table fill fruit on it and already located a corona camera and a light let's take a look at the bottom video okay i'm gonna override a standard corona material to the whole scene and increase this to maximum the contract should be 5. It's okay to me. Hit C and run the test. So, as you can see, this light represents to a sunshine go through a window and hits the 
table in this light I already set the directionality to 1 but if you want you can check 0 see how very I can say gloomy so I will leave it 1 and I'm gonna improve it here I have a bit map like this so just rock directly to this slot the text map and you can see the difference here we got some shadow of the frame on the table okay and I may choose another color for the light but what happened because I choose the Kelvin temple so I lose the text map we cannot use this way instead inside the camera we have another parameter to control it the white balance so try to increase it up to I think 14,000 15,000 kind of yep so we have the warm light represent to the sunset I think that's okay to me and let me turn off the override pretty cool I will enable the loot this is my favorite loot Polaroid maybe too much let me decrease down to 0 0.6 Kind of. okay so that's it for today I hope it's useful for your job thanks for watching and please if you like this video hit the like button appreciate so see you until the next time take care